Hi guys, here's a quick tip for improving your, your member retention processes. So we share this with our clients and it's having a, a personalized touch point, um, usually about 14 days into a new member's journey. Um, so we wanna make that super, super personalized. Even if it's automated, you can automate this and still have it seem personalized. So the email is hi member name. So hi John, how are you enjoying your workouts so far? Question mark. So hi John, how are you enjoying your workouts so far? And the important thing is the question mark. We're actually asking asking the member a question. And because it's framed as a question, something strange happens. People respond. So what you want to do is have this set up to come back to a reply email that your team, your gym team can, you know, man and, and check on a daily basis. So people will come back and say, you're going great so far, or actually, I'm not sure about this. Can I book in to see a trainer or it, it actually helps pull out any problems. So the reason 14 days is key is because as I've talked about before, your first 30 days is everything. If, if we stuff that up, you know, it's very hard to revive members beyond that if we get it wrong. So it's very important to get that first 30 days right. So 14 days gives us enough time to just check in, see how they're going and pull out any challenges or obstacles that that member's facing so that we can actually intervene and, and provide some help and support at, at the right time. So that's my tip today. If you add that personalized touch point into your member follow-up and member journey, um, I think you'll find that it um, yields some really good results. So test it out and let us know how you go.